Hey guys, Woods Farm here, Project 222. Just back out in the shop working on the scout car. Today we're gonna finish up some loose ends. We're gonna start uh, trying to get that toolbox completed and we're also gonna work on the engine deck, try to get that finished. So stick around and check it out. Okay guys, uh, we're gonna work on the toolbox a bit. Uh, keep working towards getting that completed. I'm also going to work a little bit on the rear engine deck. I'm not sure how far I'm going to get with the, those two projects, but I kind of want to finish those things up before we move on to some other stuff on the vehicle. So let's get started. Okay, so here's the toolbox. Um, basically, there, I think I'm going to add a little bit of trim on it, on the edges, and we need to make the top lid. That's probably the most complicated piece, getting that top lid done. There's This piece has a piece of material that covers it up. That's welded directly to the box itself. This area here has a drop down door. So it's a single large door. And down here, I'm not sure if there's two separate doors or just one. Uh, I gotta do some research, check some of the photos on that, but there's a door down here. So, uh, I actually have a little blowout here. I got to patch that. So a few little things to do on the box to get it done. So we'll start working on that. Here's the piano hinges for the, the uh, toolbox. Um, I just picked these up at Canadian Tire. Uh, I was going to order some slightly uh, more heavy duty ones that were weld on, but uh, they would have been a little bit more pricey and they would have taken a couple weeks to get here. So I think these are going to work just fine. The doors aren't really that heavy. They're just... 18 gauge sheet metal so these should work just fine here's the rear engine deck um, basically all i got to do for this is add some trim to the uh, two side openings and i actually think i'm going to add a little bit of trim uh, along the edges uh, that way the overlap the crack between the two pieces it's actually i'll have something in behind it um, try to keep some of the weather out and uh, it'll look a little cleaner when you're looking at it from the outside.
Okay guys, now that we got the trim finished off on the main body of the toolbox, we're gonna go ahead and start fabricating the doors. This is gonna be a little bit more complicated of a process. Gonna have to do some sheet metal bending and some rolling of edges. So I'll go ahead and show you how I'm gonna do that. Okay guys, you can see the process for making the doors. I've got the two bottom doors completed and the large middle door is also completed. Um, now I'm gonna go ahead and start working on that top lift up door. Um, it's a little more complicated than the bottom ones. Once we get that completed, I can weld on the piano hinges and we'll be able to prime the whole toolbox. <music>
Okay guys, I'm gonna wrap this video up here. Um, as you can see, the toolbox is basically completed. Um, I, had, I need to add a latch, uh, prime the inside, prime the doors, but the box is basically finished. I didn't get around to doing the trim on the engine deck. I'll show you that in the next video coming up. Uh, once this is painted, I'm gonna mount it and I will do that step as well, which I'll show you in the next video. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below. And as always, thanks for watching.